for our top story. Eagerly awaited by both the motoring public and the automobile industry, Sunshine Television, or STV, will again launch its annual awards program to seek out the Philippines' most popular automobiles. The three-month public poll for the Auto Focus People's Choice Awards, or AFPCA, gets underway on July 1, 2014, with a better field of candidate models vying for much-coveted honors. The online poll will be again be hosted on a dedicated AFPCA page on Facebook, a popular social networking site, as well as on the Autofocus website, Autofocus Online. That's www.autofocus.com.ph. After a simple procedure of liking the page and registration, the voter will be prompted and guided through a convenient process of selecting individual models in the designated categories. And from these, choosing a particular model as the Automobile of the Year pick, within seconds, any submitted vote will appear on the results page, which will rank total scores accordingly. This tally can also be publicly viewed on the AFPCA page at www.autofocus.com.ph. Like last year, a 40% weight factor on online votes will be applied in calculating a particular model's total score. For unit sales, a value of 60% will be factored in. STV will again work hand-in-hand -hand with the Stratcom Corporation with official sanction from the Land Transportation Office or LTO. No second-hand or gray market vehicle will be included in the count, which will factor in monthly unit sales from January through end September of 2014. On tap are 2014 to 2015 AFPCA Model of the Year awards in such mainstream categories as subcompact, midsize and large sedans, sports performance cars, multi-purpose vehicles or MPVs, pickups, vans, compact, midsize and large sports utility vehicles or SUVs, and an open category for models that cannot be classified in the preceding classes. There will be separate luxury classifications and model categories with significantly distinct pricing scales. From these categories, which currently comprise over 140 base models, will emerge the popular pick for the key 2014 to 2015 AFPCA Automobile of the Year prize in separate standard and luxury classifications. During an intimate informal gathering among the motoring journalists and the local auto industry executives, this is what they had to say about this year's public polls. I think that's a welcome development for the Autofocus People's Choice Award because it's going to be a level playing field amongst all participants. It's uh, a luxury car is competing against all luxury cars and the mainstream models against the mainstream models. I think it's going to be more relevant and more credible no? if an award is given to a luxury brand or to the mainstream brand. It's separation. The separation, I think, is a good direction. Uh, Mitsubishi is very excited uh, with the holding of the, this year's or 2014 uh, Autofocus People's Choice Award. Uh, we're expecting a lot of uh, entries to be filled in and uh, Mitsubishi is also gunning for some awards this year. Uh, definitely it's going to be more exciting as you know every year the organizer themselves uh, are, are, are putting in new things and it's going to be more interesting uh, products that uh, we will be showing to the public this coming event. So we're quite excited to, find, to look at uh, the result and see how the Filipinos have uh, embraced or accepted our models in the market. And uh, we're very glad that there is an autofocus that we'll be able to see this uh, feedback from the public through the boats coming in. For this award. In other industry news, Mini Asia and British United Automobiles Incorporated, the exclusive distributor and importer of Mini vehicles in the country, recently launched the new generation Mini at the Mini Global City dealership. Designed to be bigger, drives better, and packed with more technological innovation than before, the new Mini continues to be the leading original of the premium small car segment. The new uh, F56 is being launched tonight, and uh, 
the new Mini uh, for the Cooper version, it has a smaller engine, but it's more powerful. So that's the good thing about the new Cooper, no? And while the Cooper S, on the other hand, has a bigger engine, but again, it's more powerful also. So that's that's the good news about the new Mini. And at the same time, it's a little longer, okay? But also, it retains the same uh, mobility, the quickness, the nimbleness of the car is still there. So, and of course, uh, with the endless technologies that is placed in this car, is amazing. So we're all very excited about it. For the first time, both three-cylinder and four-cylinder engines are introduced, all featuring mini twin-power turbo technology. The patrol engines include turbocharging, direct fuel injection, and variable camshaft control on the intake and exhaust side. In the engines of the Mini Cooper S and Mini Cooper models, there is also fully variable valve control in the form of Valvetronic, as patented by the BMW Group. The new Mini or the new original is the, the new classic, if you like. For the longest time, Mini has produced a Mini. Now, what we've found now is the old outgoing R56 model, and we're replacing it with the new F56 model. So as you'll know, BMW always named their cars with a, an alphabetical letter, so we're on to F. So F56 is a new car. The car that you've seen here today is 100% brand new. 100% of all components, from the engine to the body panels to the small switch gear to the soft touch items inside of the car, 100% is brand new. To all the televiewers, uh, please uh, come by uh, at Mini Global City at, at Fort Bonifacio. Uh, and, and we encourage you to please test drive the vehicle because uh, nothing beats uh, testing the vehicle and, and you'll find out uh, what a beautiful car it is. The new Mini Cooper S is powered by a 2-liter 4-cylinder engine with a peak output of 192 horsepower which goes on stream between 4,700 and 6,000 RPM, delivering its maximum torque of 280 nanometer from 1,250 to 4,750 RPM. Torque can even briefly be increased to 300 nanometer by means of an overboost function.